Point those feet at the back, back, back. When Michaela Ironside jumps, both feet now touch the ground, every step in sync with her peers. I don't feel like an old man anymore because like my back doesn't hurt. It just feels normal now. Okay, should we have a look at your leg? It's a new normal for the 13-year-old. Michaela was born with a bowed tibia. Her right leg grew seven centimeters longer than the left. Like people would ask me, like, did you sprain your ankle? No, no, <laughs> my legs are just weird. <laughs> In 2014, Michaela was one of the first patients at BC Children's Hospital to have her legs lengthened using technology introduced to the province by Tony Cooper. He's one of five doctors in Canada specializing in the treatment. That's tough. Dr. Cooper broke Michaela's bone just below her kneecap and fitted her leg with a structure called a Taylor spatial device. Every night Michaela turned the pins, her bone grew by a millimeter. The human body is amazing and we just, we take advantage of that to give them a normal leg at the end of the day. Because what happens is after we cut the bone, it's trying to heal like a fracture would, and then we're not letting it heal, we keep stretching it. Once it's all healed, you can see how it's almost new bone. And it's wow. just like, it's so filled in. After a year of treatment and physiotherapy, Michaela's legs are the same length. It's so exciting how it's all finally better after a year. She's one of 30 patients whose limbs grew with Dr. Cooper's help. He says the technology is not only revolutionizing care, it's building children's confidence. They grow five centimeters when they lengthen them, but they, they seem to grow even more because they come in, their heads are held high and they're, they're smiling. Michaela is rediscovering ballet and looking forward to spending winter on two feet. I hope it snows because I really want to go tobogganing and stuff because I, I couldn't even go outside when it snowed last year because I was terrified of ice and slipping. Opposite shoulder, opposite shoulder. She says she might even Good. try skiing or skating now that she's found her balance. Tanya Beja, Global News. Good.